and action. Welcome to YouTube Celebrity Gossip News with me and Tommy. How's it going, Tommy? Well, it's going great, Chris. It's finally warming up back here in Iowa and spring is on its way and everyone's starting to get out more. Right, everyone is starting to get out here more in Washington State as well in the great northwest and uh we have some youtube celebrity gossip news so let's go to work and here we go Chris and Tommy. hey this is tommy dream and you're watching top level media So welcome back everyone. Tommy, you got some news. What do you have for us this week? Okay, YouTube is going to be starting beta testing a new uh, feature with YouTube. Uh, it's designed uh, with older kids in mind, uh, ones that are um, where the parents think that they're not ready for the craziness of uh, unrestricted YouTube, but yet at the same time, they're not wanting to watch the little kitty videos anymore because they, they've outgrown those. So uh, that's what they're gonna be starting to do. And it's gonna come in, uh, it's called, called Parental Supervisor uh, is what they're calling this thing. And there's gonna be three different levels to it. There's gonna be uh, Explore, which is gonna cater to nine and older, that, that, that range. And just you'll know, give them more age appropriate videos to that range of kids. Uh, they're still recommending uh, for kids that are under age nine to go to the YouTube Kids app. Um, and, along, and then there's Explore More, which uh, is for tweens, you know, people that are not, are in between a teenager and a, but not yet, but still, but not a kid anymore. And so that gives them access to more uh, videos that they would like, music videos, live concerts, stuff like that, things that, you know, younger uh, people of that age would, would be into tutorials about like maybe you make up hair, that sort of stuff. And also with both of these, as well as the kids app, there is no target of ad, uh, just like in the kids app, there are no target of ads, but at this level, because they're older, there are some, but just depends on the, the content they're watching. But for the most part, there's no targeted ads. Then there is most of YouTube, and this is for people uh, parents, you know, who want their kids to still experience uh, the wonders of YouTube, but they feel that their kids just cannot handle the craziness of it. Um, and that is, you know, teenagers. Um, and where that opens up even more contents, you know, uh, except for age restricted stuff, where they're going to be able to see most of, pretty much all of a video on YouTube, especially uh, topics, you know, that matter to them, like about online bullying. Uh, you know, body shaming, that sort of, uh, sort of stuff, as well as much more that, you know, things that teens are into uh, without, you know, allowing them to watch that and learn from other teenagers how to deal with the online world. Um, and along with all these, um, when they hit that age of the, of the most, when they're, you know, they're 13, but the parents still don't want them to have an actual channel. They won't be allowed to upload or comment, but they'll be able to watch the videos. Um, and they've worked with uh, people that are experts in child development of the, as they get older uh, to create this, along with parents, listening to parents and teenagers and stuff they wanted. Uh, they've been praised by uh, Parental Zone in the UK and the the national PTA here in America. Well, Tommy, well, that's good that uh, YouTube is thinking about more of the kids out there and willing to, uh, you know, look in on the YouTube app for kids, and that's an important thing. And it's a great thing, actually, just because um, um, not every little kid out there, kids watch, you know, you, like kid videos, so they're always looking at more. Um, growing up stuff so that means that that that's great that youtube is considering changing a lot of great things up about youtube and 
rolling in with those details as well. So like I said before, this is just in beta testing right now. So once everything gets finalized and they figure out, you know, the best way to implement each of the stages um, and let the parents know, you know, that how they can set it up, um, then they'll roll out to everyone else. But right now they're just beta testing it and you know still working you know make sure that they work all the bugs out and make sure that it's the best experience for each of the age groups and like i said you know if they're younger under age of nine then stick with uh the kids youtube app if they're nine and up then explore explore more if they're tweens and if they're teenagers then most of youtube uh, is what they're recommending once this does roll out but as of right now um, in both of the articles i had read there is no actual date when this will actually be available to the public. Right, okay, great. So um, what you could do is uh, look on more of the story down in the section down below of Tommy's story while it's in development. And um, you know, tell us what you think about this as well uh, by putting a comment down on the section down below. Moving on, we have Miss Lady Gaga, Tommy. Um, Lady Gaga's dog walker was out where her place is walking the dogs and two guys and Matt show up and um, her neighbor released this video actually just because it got so serious. Um, two guys show up in masks and um, will strike her uh, assistant and was just like, uh, you're gonna get it. And they what they tried to steal Lady Gaga's dogs. It was it got too serious to the point to where uh, Everybody was calling the police around her, and so the dogs did, did get kidnapped by these guys in masks, and Lady Gaga is offering $500,000 for the dog's return, or if uh, you have any information, and so not just that, so no guess of who the suspects are yet, so they um, have no suspects in custody, because, you know, obviously, um, they did get away with these dogs. That is just crazy uh, that these guys uh, would do this. Because um, it makes you think, what is their motive of stealing um, her dogs from her? Uh, one, uh, yeah, just because she's a celebrity and she's got money, maybe they're going to ransom the dogs back to her or... Uh, did that so they could get a, kidnap them and then return back the reward, which is kind of just weird to do in the first place. Because yeah, these people they are you know well known by a lot of people out there. But you take that away, you take the fame, you take the celebrities aspect out of their life. They're just like you and me. They uh, take walks. They have dogs. You know, they have pets. Uh, some have kids. Some uh, you know run marathon so in the end they're just normal people so i don't know what these two people were thinking but obviously they just weren't they were clever enough to wear a mask but overall i mean if they're if the goal is to get uh, to money there's other ways other stuff they could probably have stolen man and to do it and when there are people there that's also really stupid <laughs> Right, and of course, and when this is at night as well, too, Tommy. I mean, in the dark, yes, I get it, but you know, uh, there's got to be a lot of security around um, Lady Gaga's house, along with neighbors too. That they don't watch her house, like, oh, that's Lady Gaga. Cool, she lives right next to me. Awesome, great. The security show probably shows nothing because these guys were in mask as well. My mind is where your mind is at, Tommy. Why go to this length? to do this whatsoever you know just because there's other ways of getting money and not stealing somebody's dogs as uh tmz updates the news on this um we will let you know on this story as well be kind to animals out there they have feelings too oh okay hey, yeah be kind to animals they are awesome they're like human beings too anyways uh that's all the news that we have what can people do tommy they can click that like button. It lets people know that uh, other people out there that you like these videos. It'll help uh, us climb up the YouTube uh, algorithm. Uh, you can click that subscribe button. You can click that subscribe button and then click on the bell notification and then click all. It'll let you know when we post videos. If you are subscribed, be sure to click it and leave comments down below 
for both of our stories and check out the stuff in the description. Right, and we will be back to you soon, and um, we will be starting a stream uh, podcast, right, Tommy? Yep. Um, we will let you know more on that. We're in development with that right now, just to let you guys know. So those of you guys that, or you women, or anybody could come in and say hi to us, and, you know, um, we're talking about bringing some people on as live guests, too, as well. This is just uh, another... A uh, way to engage with our audience and uh, try something new uh, that we haven't tried before. Exactly. So, this has been a top level video, and we will see you later as well. Bye for now. Stay safe out there.